guys, I hope you're having a great day. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. In this video, as you've seen from the title already, I'm gonna be creating a makeup look and doing a review as well. This Makeup Revolution Eye Glisten Liquid Eyeshadows. This is a brand new thing to me. I tried quite a few different liquid eyeshadows, but because I have super hooded eyes, the liquid on the eyes kinda, those two don't really work together, if you know what I mean. So I'm gonna try to do my best and create a makeup look that would actually stay on my super hooded eyes. This is actually brand new. I haven't opened these yet or anything, so I have literally no clue what to expect. By the way, these were gifted to me by Makeup Revolution and I'm super grateful for it. So I thought I'm gonna quickly do a little review video and create a makeup look using these. Do you guys have these already? Does it work for you? Leave a comment down below, let me know, because this is honestly a new thing to me. This, by the way, reminds me the Huda Beauty one a lot. So it's all still sealed in the original, you know that plastic wrap that you get on? So first one is I Glisten, yours truly. Look at that glitter are you guys oh my god one side is kind of like a metallic chrome part let's see yeah like a chrome does it blend easier yeah oh okay i love it and then the glitter part okay oh wow you guys wow okay i wasn't expecting that all right let's check out the ice glisten it's fate this one is like a proper gold guys oh my god and then the gold part the glitter this gold one looks very festive for me or like for festivals or for like christmas i don't know it just associates but this is like a cool tone gold and then i have like more of a yellow one so this one is called dun 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 dreamland oh i love the name oh this when swatching this looks proper bronze color I think I like the bronze one more than the gold one. So far, really, so good. <laughs> I'm really impressed. I'm like a child on a Christmas. Okay, next one we got is the Eyes Glisten Adored by You. The light pink, more like a baby pink color. Oh, you guys. Look at that pigment in there. This one is not as much glitter as these parts were. It's more like a glitter is very tiny. It's definitely there. Okay, and the last but not least is kind of like a red color one. So this one is Eyes Glisten Desired. Love the names, by the way. All right, let's do the chrome part first. This is really intense, you guys. This is the most pigmented of all. Wow. Okay. It's definitely there, no denying in that. So far, it looks amazing. I can't fool in any way or anything. I'm a bit scared how it's gonna work on my super hooded eyes. So I think without any further ado, we should just go and create the eye makeup look. Right, you guys, so I already did this eye because I couldn't decide what look I should go for. Plus, this is a liquid eyeshadow. I have hooded eyes. That's a tough thing. But so far, you guys, I finished this eye and it haven't creased or anything. So I'm really, really impressed. So I think without any further ado, let's do this eye so you guys can see exactly how I did this. But wait, I haven't applied falsies yet because I'm not too sure if I want to falsies or not. I just did mascara. So I started from the Dana Alturwish collaboration palette with Makeup Revolution. I did a review on this by weights up on my channel if you guys want to check it out and create a makeup look as well using it. So I'm just gonna go and mix two colors, the beige and the white one, and go on my transition color. By the way, my lids are already prepped and primed, so it's ready to go. If you want a separate video on how I'm prepping my eyes so the eyeshadow would increase throughout all the day, leave a comment down below and I can film it for you. So I'm gonna show if you guys know this already and I don't wanna waste your precious time by showing you that all in one video. And go as a transition color. When I say transition color, I mean higher than my creases. So I'm just keeping my eyes relaxed so I see exactly where my eye creases.
Next thing I'm doing, I'm actually jumping straight away to this eye glisten liquid eyeshadow. So I'm taking the one called Desired and the Chrome part and I'm gonna go all over my mobile lid. So starting closer to the lash line using the applicator that is provided and basically just going messy, don't really care the way I apply because we're gonna obviously blend this out. So taking the brush now and just blending the color. I start blending closer to the lash line and then I'm dragging the color up to the crease and slightly bit higher than the creases. Okay, so I like the color already, so I'm just gonna leave it the way it is and apply the eyeliner. To be honest, you guys, I just unpacked this eyeliner and tried for the first time. It's the Liner Revolution by Makeup Revolution, and oh my god, you guys, it looks like a pen. That's why it's so super easy to use. I'm actually obsessed with Tarte's Manator liner because it's so easy to use and it looks like a pen. But this one, you guys, that's a really strong contender for that and it's a bargain price it's super easy to draw the liner because it's a pen so there's no mess and it gives you that precision yeah couldn't recommend this more i was like shook when i started using it so i was like whoa whoa okay so i'm starting from the inner eye corner going very close to the lash line and then i'm gonna go and draw the flick because my eyes are super hood i always draw it while my eyes are open and then i close my eyes and kind of you know So the eyeliner is on already. What I did, I took a wet wipe and cleaned off all the fallouts and tidy up this part because it had a little bit of the eyeshadow on. So if you got super heavy hand and you went messy with your eyeliner or anything, you can always take a wet wipe, wrap around your finger and clean up this part. I showed this trick in many of my videos, so I'm not gonna show it in this one. So next thing I'm doing, I'm just gonna take the mascara. This one surprisingly is from the Primark. I did a video using just Primark's makeup. I'm not sure if it's already on my channel or it's gonna be coming after this one, but this mascara. Who knew that primer does nice mascara? So I'm gonna go with this one. I started applying mascara and then realized I haven't finished my makeup look. I mean I still need to do the in eye corner and the lower lash line so I'm just gonna finish off the mascara on the top lashes and we're gonna do the rest. I don't know where is my right now. <laughs> I was in sore. So I'm coming back to the Donna Ultra Beige palette by Revolution and the color beige and I'm gonna go all over my lower lash line. I'm coming back to the eye glisten in the color Adored by You and the actual glitter part. I'm gonna take some on a brush and I'm gonna go in my inner eye corner. I'm taking another eye gloss and liquid eyeshadow in the color yours truly and I'm gonna go with the glitter part. So once again, gonna take some on the brush and gonna go in the inner eye corner. All right, so now we can apply the mascara on the lower lash line as well. I don't know why I applied before the mascara straight away. So I'm just gonna quickly do my face and come back to use and we'll see if this eyeshadow creased at all or no. So the foundation and a little bit of contour and all is on. So you know what? I decided I'm gonna add the falses. I mean, I'm just gonna go with little accents. So these ones are Ardell, the magnetic accents. These basically gonna go just on the outer corner of the eye. I did a video on showing how to apply the magnetic lashes and accents. It's on my channel if you guys want to check it out. So I'm just gonna quickly do that and go back to it. And the makeup look is complete. What do you think, guys?
So what I think about these eye glisten liquid eyeshadows by Makeup Pro Lotion. So I did this eye face, when I did this eye review, just check this out. The liquid eyeshadow haven't creased or flaked or anything whatsoever on my hooded eyes. I mean, usually with liquid eyeshadows, it's really, really hard to work. So normally if I would go and apply the liquid eyeshadow, I would need to apply it on and then wait with my eyes closed for it to dry so it would increase or flake because my eyes are that hooded but this one you haven't happened anything you haven't creased it haven't flaked thumbs up makeup revolution amazing job in the creating this formula i'm impressed and then this glitter part it's super easy to use as you see because normally with a glitter you need a glitter primer at first and then you know apply glitter sometimes it can get messy and you can have loads of glitter fallouts and all but because this is liquid you have zero fallouts i mean have you seen any of the glitter parts falling in here so i haven't so humongous humongous thumbs up for me i just can't imagine how many creative makeup looks I can create using these because now I went very subtle just with a glitter in the inner eye corner but you know you can go big <laughs> and have a glitter all over your lid or on a low lash light whatever you feel like I think this is an amazing product and in my opinion it's a Huda Beauty liquid eyeshadow dupe you can go and compare yourself if you don't believe but for me this is an amazing amazing product we'll be definitely using this so I really hope you guys enjoyed watching this quick review and tutorial video and you found this helpful if so please don't forget to press the thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more and leave a comment down below let me know if you already tried this liquid eyeshadows by makeup revolution so thank you so much for watching and i'll see you soon in my next video have a good day guys bye